All right, in this small video, I'm going to guide you through making a uh, a part on Eagle for the ESP03, which is uh, ESP8266 IC module, uh, Wi-Fi module. This part is pretty simple. It's just surface mount, but I'm gonna go ahead and try and at least draw out the board so we have a feel of where we're laying. Um, first, let me know that when you go online and buy this, you're not gonna find a good drawing of the dimensions. They give you three here, but you usually get stuck with how to draw the pads because how far the first pad is from the edge, they don't even tell you. So I went ahead and made my own, took my own picture of mine measured it using my caliper and put it online for everyone so first thing I, the first thing I always do is I start by making the actual part part or package alright we know this is the ESP 8266 and this is the ESP 03 module Okay, this module is 17.45 high and 12.16 length. Okay, so let's first start off by drawing, start off on zero and just draw it out the, I guess, the whole module. Point one. Let's see. It's let's put 12.2. Let's let's just use these at least. 12.2 and 17.4. We follow it on top here. I'm using uh, the wire tool with layer 21. So it's 12.2. And 17.4 and we go back down to our center and that's exactly how big our part is okay now from the bottom to the top it's one millimeter from the center pad our pads are one by Point five, but we need to make it a little bit bigger. The height we leave the same as one, but instead of point 0.5, we're going to use one also. So it's five point five millimeters in and out. So we have something for it to land on. Now from the center, it says from the bottom or edge, we're point 0.1 up. I mean one millimeter up. So go up one millimeter. We can always set this to 1 and our center will be 1. Then it's every 2 millimeters is a pad. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 pads. Is it 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7? Sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. And from edge to edge, it's 12.16. So we, easiest way, select all your pads. Get ready to copy. Change it to, I, I guess we use 12.2 here. As you can see, center. And just select any one, copy and move it over and this is basically it now all we have to do is actually number these <coughs> as you can see from the top left it starts at number one goes oh, I can't barely even see this <coughs> this looks like 14 how in the hell is this oh this isn't even one this is one in the bottom right Wow, that was confusing. Okay, so this is one. We just go around. Eight is right there. I 
can tell because it says 14, 13, 12, 11, 10. I can't really see the rest, but you can get the gist of it. Okay, all our pins are um, made. We could go ahead and just, for fun, try to draw where our antenna will actually land. Oops. Okay, the antenna looks center a little bit, probably about 0.5 to 1, 1 millimeter, probably 0.5 millimeters from top pad to there. We, we're not even going to do this perfect, we just, so we have a, an idea of where it might be. That looks pretty good, I guess. If you want, you can go ahead and <laughs> use the measuring tool to make it perfect. This is 1.3. Oh. This is 1.2. It's good enough. I'm not going to go crazy. Alright, let's go ahead and give this a name. So tag. We want give it a permanent tag. <coughs> go ahead and save it. And next let's create our symbol. pins so seven on each side you go ahead and get lazy and just copy pins and rotate I like to prepare everything with a name here this actually doesn't matter where the names are as long as they're all there um, this is GPIO 14 12 13 then 15 2 Save this and create our device. Our device we will call it this. Okay, now we just connect our pins. I'm gonna drag this down so it's not in the way or on the side. Okay. Bring this. Let's 
good enough. Okay. Starting from pin one, then it's automatically gonna keep going down this list. So we know ground, no connect, TXD, RXD. Ground, no connect, TXD, RXD. 16, CH, antenna. <coughs> BCC. 14, 12, 13, 15, 14, 12, oops, take that back out, 8 is 14, 12, 15, oops, 13, 15, 2, oh, I'm going crazy here, I didn't even put the antenna which was on 7, Seven antenna BCC fourteen twelve thirteen fifteen fourteen twelve thirteen fifteen two zero. Guess this is a good reason to make sure your mouse works. Okay, and we should be done. I guess. Thanks for watching.